Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. The time has finally come. The time has uh, finally come for our crypto riches, everyone, because the world's largest asset manager, BlackRock, which controls trillions and trillions of dollars worth of your assets, well, I guess if you invest in their retirement fund, like my assets, um, it's getting into the Bitcoin game. They gave the okay for two funds on BlackRock to invest in Bitcoin futures. Now, I generally don't like futures because it gives another way to manipulate the market. Like futures ETFs, you know, those are all like ways that you can actually kind of be in Bitcoin without actually buying Bitcoin. But this is the one of the reasons why I say like these things are necessary for the maturation of the uh, asset class. And we've come full circle. The world's largest asset manager appears to be getting into the Bitcoin game. Now, BlackRock and Fidelity and stuff like that, because of regulations and all the uncertainty, they may not actually buy directly into Bitcoin. They're much more likely to buy into these futures or funds. So that's why these are necessary, like especially the ETF. I think that opens up a whole new way of investing for a lot of big institutions. But this is like kind of like, you know, it's finally landed. And we're finally going to see a lot of investment, maybe in retirement and pensions. And this is from BlackRock. BlackRock, the world's largest asset manager with uh, 7.81 trillion under management. That's right, 7.81 trillion under management appears to have granted at least two of its funds the ability to invest in Bitcoin futures, which are directly tied to Bitcoin. Now, if they're invested in Bitcoin futures, that means their kind of like future is uh, kind of like co basically in line with Bitcoin. So they don't want Bitcoin to go down. And with more investments in Bitcoin futures, I definitely think Bitcoin will continue to go up. Prospectus documents filed with the U.S. SEC Wednesday indicate that BlackRock Global Allocation Fund and BlackRock Funds V are at least eyeing Bitcoin. They both include the world's oldest cryptocurrency on their list of derivative products cleared for use. So Bitcoin derivatives might be uh, cleared for use as long as they file with the SEC. That is a big, big step. This is like the first really, really, really big asset manager to actually put some of their money in their funds into anything cryptocurrency-ish. Fidelity, even though they... Uh, you know, like blockchain and cryptocurrency, they didn't actually put their money where their mouth is. It looks like BlackRock is finally going to take the plunge. BlackRock did not state which commodity exchange it will choose to execute these crypto futures buys. However, the funds may only invest in cash settled Bitcoin futures. That's kind of a letdown, but you know, like one step at a time, one step at a time. So they're probably going to use CME or something. CME is the only exchange registered with the CFTC that offers similar uh, futures products at the time. So man, BlackRock coming in, even if it's only cash settled futures, it is a big, big step uh, forward for Bitcoin. And I'm hoping that eventually they can actually uh, invest in Bitcoin settled futures and then Bitcoin itself. The filings warn that investments in these futures could carry like illiquidity risks due to the relatively new market. Regulatory changes, volatility, and valuation risks could similarly weigh in on the price and thus adversely impact the fund. But dude, if I had a BlackRock fund that could actually invest in these, I would definitely tell my fund manager to actually invest in these because I really do believe in Bitcoin. And I think it'll rise faster than the rest of the coins, which means my retirement fund could go up a lot faster than most other people. I'm actually going to check that tonight to see if I can actually put some in these Bitcoin funds because I really like it. So that's kind of the news for today. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.